What's up, everybody? Here's more extended gameplay clips. This time we have Bray Wyatt, the Eater of Worlds, versus the unstable one, Dean Ambrose. Hope you guys like it. Check it out. It's no surprise that someone the likes of Dean Ambrose would utilize a lethal maneuver like his dirty deeds finisher. Oh, it's awesome. Oh, he looks like he's in no man's land here. He needs to be able to put things back together here. Michael, this is a dangerous position to be in. He needs to be able to find a way to clear the cobwebs and regroup. When Ambrose nails an opponent with that, you can hear everyone in the arena gasp at the same time. That move's annihilating. Ambrose took to create his offensive armory, if you will. The Dirty Deeds is a finisher that reflects Ambrose in-ring offensive philosophy. Fast, lethal, and out of nowhere. Oh, cool. You nail them, and there's a really good chance they felt the force of the Dirty Deeds finishing move, courtesy of Dean Ambrose. Executing the reversal. Look at this. Bray Wyatt doing some good work here. You know, Michael, we've talked about the career of Dean Ambrose, leading the unstoppable force. No Hamill clutch locked in, wrenching on the neck and lower back. Oh, he looks like he's in no man's land here. He needs to be able to put things back together here. Michael, this is a date. He's in big trouble. cheating if you don't get caught. I mean, it just blows my mind that the official didn't catch him in the act. Yeah, Ray Charles could see that. Dean Ambrose has taken control. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. Look at it this way. He's endured heavy blows here. I don't know how much longer he can go. The referee may have to call this match, King. Oh, my gosh, this is awful. I'm going to tell you something. Whatever you know history of Bray Wyatt, you're right. We practically know nothing. We know about Rowan and Harper. Be King, we spoke about Bray Wyatt, and it's not every day a superstar enters WWE's ranks and almost nothing is known about their personal life. I'll throw something out there. I think it's safe to say Bray Wyatt has lived a life filled with macabre visions. He keeps us in the dark because he wants us close to where he rests. For taking and dishing out ungodly amounts of punishment. To fans around the world, Ambrose emerged in 2012 as the eccentric leader of the Hounds of Justice, known as the Shield. Oh, Ambrose emerged as the leader of the Shield, all right. When they arrived in WWE, the Hounds of Justice planned... folks. This guy's just getting worn out. And now Bray Wyatt could have this match in the back. Get 
some air here. I need some too after sitting next to you. 